Hey there, it's Jenny, and I'm here today to share with you how I planned this week in my mini vertical happy planner. This week is all about doing different stuff. So first of all, I'm using these really small little date numbers from Sunshine Sticker Co. I'll link up the shop down below. I really am enjoying these because the dates are super subtle and I don't need them to be crazy big or anything like that. And they're really affordable. I think there's like six months or five months on this sheet. So it's going to last me a long time. Now I've got it dated and I'm going to use mini mouse this week. So the difference here is that I'm going to use a lot of washi too. And I haven't used a lot of washi in a spread in a long time, but I want the washi to be sort of not the focal point, but a very large part of the design. So I'm going to create some vertical or not vertical, I'm sorry, diagonal washi strips to accent the stickers. So first of all, I laid that the washi down and then now I have Minnie Mouse peeking over the edge of the sidebar, which I think is really adorable. And I also want to use one of the really big Minnie Mouses, which is kind of crazy because the scale is really big in the mini planner, but I'm going to have her just fall off the edge ever so slightly and then I will trim that off right there. It doesn't have to be overly done or anything like that. Just a little bit to give myself a little bit more room for Thursday and Friday. Saturday and Sunday I don't have any plans so I don't have anything that I'm going to be writing so it works out. We're going to go with a second swatch of diagonal washi and again I am trimming it off on the lines so that they lay flat with the lines and then right here as close to her dress as I can get without following the line of the sticker. Like I still want the edge to be straight. So you can see the two points here and I'm going to make a third of course, as I always do with my washi and a sticker. Sorry, everything is shaking so much. I'm really having a hard time getting all of this together. I know that's such a weird thing to say, but I've been changing my filming setup since January. And so it's just really been a struggle for me to get this all together. All right, so totally not happy with how it is right now. And the stickers are fine. The washi, I hate that it goes all in the same direction. So I'm going to start laying down my activity stickers and then I'll work it out as I go. I know that once I have the stickers down, things will appear a little bit different. And if I give myself a little bit of time, it will, a new ideas will sort of generate on how to make this look a little bit better. Now I did want to use a little bit washi of washi as a grounding piece for an activity sticker. So that's what you'll see right there. And it also brings that polka dot washi over to the right hand side as well. Now I'm going to do the exact same thing, but with a smaller piece of washi right below it. So again, we're creating sort of a, I don't know, like a tight little cluster of little washi strips right there. Obviously I could have done it on the other side, but I wanted to keep them next to each other to do exactly what we did right there, like kind of walls of washi, if you will. So you can see right there by simply adding those boxes, it really changed the look of the layout a lot. So I don't hate the washi strips anywhere near as much. And thanks to the little heads, I wanted to just add a little more pop of decor. So that's why I put those in the corners right there. Same thing with the bow on the top. It's simply about dressing up those boxes since those stickers are available. Now I'll go in and add the plans and do this for the exact same reason that I already mentioned, which is that I'm just giving myself a little bit more time to think through the final design of this layout. By writing it in, I get a little bit more comfortable and I can see where I feel like mm, I might need something over here or it may all feel more cohesive when I'm finished because a lot of times the problem is that without anything else on there, it just doesn't quite feel right. So now you can see we're basically finished there. Not completely though, but we're going to add a couple more things and we will be done. Thanks so much for stopping by and watching. I really do appreciate it. If you have any questions, please leave it in the comments box below and I'll do my best to get back to you. Thanks so much and make it a great day.